time, Addison School. It is the bricks, and it is time for our final edition of Piggy and Elephant Storytime. As usual, I will be playing Piggy, Peyton will be playing Gerald the Elephant, and Will is going to be Penguin the Ice Cream Man. Our story today is, Should I Share My Ice Cream? This is a perfect story as we head in to the hot days of summer. Special shout out to author and illustrator Mo Willems for letting us share this book with you. So here we go. Should I share my ice cream? Ice cream, get your ice cream for a hot day. Oh boy, ice cream. One ice cream, please. Here you go. Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy, I love ice cream. Wait, Piggy loves ice cream too. Piggy's my best friend. Should I share my ice cream with her? Should I share my awesome, yummy, sweet, super great, uh, tasty, nice, cool ice cream? Hmm. 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 Maybe Piggy does not like this flavor. Sharing a flavor Piggy does not like would be wrong. I will eat the ice cream. Wait. Piggy will like this flavor. It is very yummy. I will share my ice cream. It will not be easy. Hey, Piggy is not here. She doesn't know I have the ice cream. I will eat the ice cream. Where is Piggy? What if she's sad somewhere? I must find her. When I do, I will say, would you like some of my ice cream? Then she will say, Thank you. That would cheer me up. Then I will give her my ice cream to share. Yum. Then my best friend will be happy. I will do it. I will share my ice cream. No! Now Piggy cannot have any of the ice cream. Now I can't have any of my ice cream. I blew it. Oh, you look sad. Well, would you like some of my ice cream? Thank you. That would cheer me up. Yum. That was not my plan. Oh well, this works too. And that's the story of Should I Share My Ice Cream. Madison School, it's been a pleasure sharing the Elephant and Piggy Story Hour with you over the last few weeks. We hope you guys have an awesome summer and we can't wait to see you in the fall. So long from the bricks. Bye guys. Bye. Bye.